Cassie, while you were in Canada, of course, you, yeah. you, you, you enjoyed your life there, you felt very comfortable. I did. And you decided <laughs> while you were there that you would come out. Yes, I, I was, I, this, it all, this always comes up because everyone's like, so, you know, you didn't come out when you were in Ireland, but then you went to Canada and you came out. And I was like, I didn't realize I was gay in Ireland, to be honest. So and I know that, you know, you are born this way and everything, but I didn't realize. And that's a story I've heard so many more times since talking to people and coming out and people know my story. And there's people in their 30s, their 40s who are only realizing. So it's not, you know, I, I wish I knew when I was a teenager because that would have made things a lot easier. Especially, I wouldn't have had to have loads of boyfriends and all that kind of stuff, you know. We <laughs> gone straight to girlfriends, so it would have. I would have saved a lot of money on Christmas presents and all that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I like to think about it. Um, but yeah, so it was very much that. I just, I, I guess, I grew into the person I was meant to, always meant to be, and that's just happened timing-wise. The stars aligned while I was in Canada. Yeah. Okay. And so, you met Kathleen. Yes, Kathleen. I met her there. The most Irish name in the whole world, <laughs> and the most French Canadian you'll ever meet. Um, so and you took her home again? I did. I was like, well, come on, come, to, come over to Ireland. Yeah, I, I actually, we broke up for a year. I moved to London, then moved back over here for, for this, which was brilliant. And then she decided to come over. So her job is, uh, she's lucky enough that she could be yeah, she here in it. And yeah, she seems huh? to like it. I think she likes it more than me, actually. It, but is it lovely being around your family again, especially, and poor Kathleen, because your granny is like the star of your Instagram account. Yeah, my grandma is pretty amazing. Um, she is 93 years old. Her name is Anna May, and she is just um, sensational, has the be most positive outlook on life. I mean, she had nine kids, so she didn't want to have oh, a positive wow. outlook on life. Grew up right next, I grew up right next door to my grandparents. Uh, we have a house beside them, like my family home. For me, growing up, a big moment I remember in cinema was seeing Lord of the Rings and seeing Ian McKellen, because I'm gay, and that was a huge moment to see myself represented on.